Hey guys, group on the way back. I'm Rick. Eric. I'm Calvin. Aaron. We're back with S Class. Yes. Well, yes, last time on Paintball to decide the fate of Kuro Sensei. Mm-hmm. Yes. And, and knife ball. Nagi saw it oh. was like a paint bolt of lightning out of the clear blue sky. Knife paint. Knife paint. Like the, what, what's it called? Yellow Flash? Yeah. Naruto? Yeah. Something like that. Right? It's been a long time since we watched those. Oh, just the flash. No. The blur. It's not cool. The blue blur. It's not the fastest thing alive. Um. He's not the fastest thing alive. He's the fastest man. What about the song? Sonic, he can really move. He's the fastest thing alive. Yeah. It's in the song. They don't. They can't. They can't lie in the lyrics. We will flash, which is not the fastest thing. <laughs> no one mentioned Sonic. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm excited to see what happens in the culmination of this paintball fight. We only have two people left, right? Yeah. Both of them. Yeah. Karma. Yeah. I think so. One on one. Yeah. We <laughs> karma. Well, the only place communism hasn't reached. I forget what it was. I think it's communism. No, 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 it was the opposite. Capitalism. Capitalism. Oh, yeah. well, capitalism hasn't reached. <laughs> Spice. Spice. <laughs> so oh, for the only space. the only threshold they haven't passed yet is time travel. Well, we haven't gone to space. We yet. haven't. Yeah. We're going to space. You don't know that. We might only go in the air. Oh my but God! Not... Is that what the next Fast and Furious is gonna do? No. Time travel? No. Yeah. No. They're busy Go with... back and get those DVD players. Yeah. They have three parts? <sighs> it's the goal all along. The whole time. We're going underwater with Aquaman. We could do that, too. Oh, yeah. He's in that, isn't he? The final frontier. All right. Deep sea exploration. We're going to space. Space. Well, we're stopping something that's going from space to America. No. Well, well from America to space. They're intercepting something. There's research being done up there. Yeah. Yes. And that is going to be going to America. We have to stop that. We, we have, have to, to intercept, intercept it. it. Intercept yeah. it. By taking a, a test rocket being built in Japan and taking the dummies out. I don't know what could go wrong. And replacing them with children. Yeah. yeah. Which and are then probably boarding, fairly equivalent in weight. Yeah, and then either boarding the station or boarding whatever is sent from the space station to Earth. Yeah. I hope they hijack the ISS. Sounds like a bad idea. Sounds like a great plan. There's no plan there. Yeah, it is. It's a plan. No, there's there's an idea. There's not a plan. It's like the all idea. ideas, all plans start as ideas. No, the here. idea is that we save Koro Sensei is the plan... by curing him. The plan is we get the information by hijacking and and taking the the dummies out of a spaceship. That's like saying like and then taking the it idea up to the is the ISS. I'm, I'm behind on my house and they're gonna take my house. If I don't pay. The plan is we're gonna rob a bank. It's like no, that's not a plan. That's well, the idea the was idea. to get the information from the space station and. Step one of the plan is to hijack a spaceship. Yeah. The plan is in motion. I don't like this. You know what it's better than? Strapping a jet to a car and is shooting it, that off. It's is so, it yes. Is it it's better? so it's much better. better than that. <laughs> no, it's not. It's so much better. This thing is intended for space. It doesn't just have fucking duct tape on the window seals. Basically, they're just stowing away on a perfectly fine... I- Space I don't understand vessel. the yeah. issue of the other space vessel that we talked about. I think that's fine. If you don't understand. I'll always remember that cut to them in the dra- driver and passenger seat in space. <laughs> so funny. I love it. I have accepted it. But it's really funny. It's great. <laughs> the fight was great. I really loved it. Yep. Yeah. It was, it was good. It reminded me, especially the knife part, reminded me of... Uh, you see the fight scenes from Hunted with Benicio oh, Del Toro fuck and yeah. Tommy Lee Jones. Oh, Lee Jones. Yeah. Maybe the best knife fight I've ever seen in my life. Uh, see, when you said, I thought you were going to talk about uh, Under Siege. Nope. With Tommy Lee Jones. Yep. No. No. Deep in Seagal. Not was They're not just waving that. knives around and then overlaying. Ching, 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 ching. I was thinking Metal Gear Solid 3. They're in camo. Oh, yeah. Oh, fuck. I guess took him down with a nice hole. You should have yep. shot him. In the forest. Yeah, but he wanted all of the students <clears throat> to be on the same side rather than, ah, oh, that was a cheap shot. I get you, but I feel like, well, was it a cheap shot? Isn't that? That's, I mean, that was Nagisa's reasoning I, I for saying, it. okay, I'm going to go. But if Nagisa mono, lost mono. the hand-to-hand fight, would then the blue team be like, well, he, we should have won anyway. He had the shot. He just did it because 
you guys would have been sore losers. Like, it, you, yeah, you could have created it's, a... It's a... F- you know what I'm saying? Like, it's karma's advantage either yeah. way. Either, like, he loses and his team still doesn't want to go along with the plan. Yeah. Or he wins and he gets his way, but the blue team well, I mean, still like, loses out, right? They had the one people that were, like, good sharpshooters, and they were just shooting people from yeah. safety. Yeah. Why well, can't Nagisa shoot karma from safety? If, if, if their, 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 their history was too much, I guess. If Kirby hits you with a hammer, yeah. and you fly off the stage and die. Yeah. Or he sucks and spits you off the bottom. Accepted. Yeah. Yeah, I exactly, right? Yeah. What do you mean? Yeah, but it, it's so much harder to suck and spit. Yeah. No, Rick's right. <laughs> <laughs> I accidentally will hit you with a hammer sometimes. <laughs> I, I bet Aaron $1,000, uh-huh. and he hits him with a hammer. I yeah. give him the 1000 yeah, I still give him a thousand if he sucks and spits, but I am not happy. You're, about you're covering the money in shit first. I agree. <laughs> you should donate that money to science. Aaron, donate a thousand dollars to science for all the times to you science. suck and spit us. Every time? Yeah. No. For all the times. That's too many thousands of dollars. <laughs> not enough money in the world. <laughs> so the idea is we have the month of January. He explodes on March 13th, March. so they got this month, and then come February, we go back to kill him. What do you think the chances are? Low. I feel like they're low, Yeah. Just given that time frame. <laughs> I feel like the answer isn't in the space station, because if yeah. it was, they would use it. Mm-hmm. So, like, it might give them a starting point. Yeah. Maybe the answer is the space station. It wasn't on the moon, that's for sure. He was on the moon, though. Yeah, yeah but, but the research was. There's still gravity on the moon. There's no gravity yeah, in the up. space station. Yeah, but up. there's no gravity on the space station, and Maybe, it hasn't blown up. I suppose that's true. Maybe that matters, or anti-matters. Guys, thank you very much for watching this episode of Assassination Classroom. Make sure you're coming back next week, where we maybe start the process to go to space. Or I should say, just steal a spaceship. It's a good, it's a good start. <laughs>